next other goals. Number two, 500 subscribers. You know, it's not something I, you know, need, of course, but it's something that, uh, you know, seeing grow, basically growth is what this is. Uh, you know, work hard on my content and collaborate. Uh, straight to number four, collaborate with more people, like maybe potentially, like it's Top Shelf and those awesome guys, uh, Donny TV, those awesome guys, Lucky Lag, uh, DG Gaming. And and dot frisk all those awesome people in the community. I would love to work with and you know even maybe, maybe some other you know not even just MLB, uh maybe some Madden games or 2K you know just any some type of collaboration not just you know just to do it but you know to have fun and meet new people and you know we be friends with other people, uh in the same community that I am. I would love to do that. So if any of you are watching this that video, uh. Not, not to, uh, you know, mention it, but I'm joking. Alright, boys. You know how I like uh, doing some pretty savage stuff. You know how we're pretty savage here at the Go Herd. What I want to do, okay, boys, is this person that I'm going to link his channel in. I want everyone to go sub to him, okay? Uh, he is about 40 off from 1,000, and this dude freaking grinds, bro. He freaking grinds. So I want all of you guys to go sub to him real quick, okay? We're not raiding him right now. I just want everyone to go sub to him and then come back, obviously, and watch the rest of the stream. But here you guys go. Hang on. Everyone go sub to this fool. I want everyone right now to go sub to him. Let's get him over 1,000. I don't even freaking care, boys. I do not even freaking care. Uh, yeah, he is 28 off. Easy work, boys. Freaking easy work, bro. 23 off. Keep going, fam. 20 off. Hang on. I want to see this live. I want to see this live, boys. Oh, crap. We only got a minute 28 pause time left. Yeah, ho he might not even be in here anymore. If he's not, that would be freaking hilarious. Because then he would have no idea what the F just happened. <laughs> he would have no idea what the F just happened. Let's see here. Yeah, he was 45 off, 35 off, and now he is load. Load your butthole. We did it, boys. We freaking did it, boys. Oh, my God. <laughs> we got him way over 1,000. GG, boys. G freaking D. You guys are animals, man. What is going on, guys? Welcome back to another video. And today, it's going to be a different type of video like... Uh, unlike my normal videos, today is a video, <laughs> uh, I did one last year around, I think around this time, maybe the same exact date, um, uh, about my year, uh, the past year on YouTube, and, um, life in general, <clears throat> and just like a little update, and just to look through on 27, well, 2016 then, uh, but 2017 in this one, uh, it's by TubeBuddy, and and it's a push to start thing a year in review i'm gonna leave the sound off you can't hear it either way uh let's just start it i'm gonna go over some stuff first let's go back to i believe it's gonna show us where i started 2017 january 1st i began 2017 with 179 subscribers 25.7k channel views and only 377 uploads my top three videos of 2017 based on views. My Is It Worth It series, How to Unlock King Griffey Jr. Breakout, and How to Unlock the Reds King Griffey Jr., which I believe I think it was one of the first people to post that. Subscriber gained 20, in 2016, I gained 112 subscribers over the year and 23.9k channel views and 432 uploads. I ended the year, let's see, I. I gained 2.95, I gained 2.9k, almost 3k subscribers in 2017, 138,000 channel views, and I uploaded 221 videos. Wow. <laughs> That's pretty insane. I gained 2.95k. I have that sitting at 3 of point per th 13 subscribers apparently. Uh, you know, it's 3.12, but 164 lifetime channel views and just short of 
today actually I'm gonna be posting two videos today it will be my 600th upload that's pretty cool that's pretty cool Wow this I started I started 2017 with 179 subscribers that's just really awesome the fact that I've gained so much support and just acknowledgement is that even a word I don't know so much uh, relevant not even that's a terrible word to say relevance that it's a terrible word to use in that situation uh a lot more people know who I am because of all the awesome people in the OMG community that helped me out and uh, are good I'm good friends with uh just to name a few M. Frisk is the man M. Frisk he helps everyone out he is without a doubt I would not without a doubt not be where I am without him uh, Mighty Goat I've known him since he had 100 subscribers he is a good friend of mine Coogs Twin Gaming TV uh, RGS Race Gaming Sports there, there's this so many, so many people to name uh Draftnet Gaming, Healy, Healy, uh, you know, if I don't say someone's name, please don't feel offended, I'm just going off the top of my head, this isn't a scripted video or anything, it's just me giving my thoughts, and just off the top of my head, and honestly, all of, everyone, everyone, the supporters, the, my good friends in the Elmi community, means so much to me that you guys are here, and that... I've had a chance to meet you all. Uh, <laughs> sounds really cliche, but it's the truth. Uh, wow, um, I think... I know I played the clip in the beginning of the video. Uh, I believe I hit 1,000 subscribers uh, during a Mighty Goat livestream. And he was like... I think I was around 800 subscribers. And I was talking about it with Mighty Goat in his chat. Of course, there was... I don't remember how many subscribers he had then. I believe it was around June, July. Uh, I believe he had around 50,000, I think, at least, subscribers. And maybe even lower. Uh, but I remember we were just talking about it. And uh, he decided to post my link in the chat. A bunch of people subbed to me. Uh, came over and supported me. And I hit, hit that 1,000 mark. And I made a video about it. I gave away a just an autographed Josh Donaldson hat. And I felt really, really good about myself. I felt really good about myself for one, even hitting my 2016 goal. That that'll probably be played in the beginning of the video as well. My not my 2016, my 2017 goal. My 2017 goal was oh god, get 500 subscribers. And if we go down, I am at 3.13k. I, I can't say how humble I am. The the amount I I appreciate everyone. Oh man, it's when I hit 1K, I was excited. I as you all know, I'm only 14. Um, I believe I know a lot more than the average 14 year old when it comes to uh, editing, graphics, recording, etc. Uh. But that's just, you know, a thing to help me keep my head up during tough times. And, you know, it's stuff I enjoy doing YouTube, uh, playing LB the show, recording for such an awesome audience. The video I uploaded the other day made a bunch of people laugh. And I, when I read those comments, I just had a huge, huge smile on my face. And I just couldn't stop smiling for a good, a good 10 minutes. It, the, the, the support... I think I've said this so many times, but I, I won't ever stop saying it. Whenever I hit a new milestone, whenever I hit a new goal, whenever I do something good, whenever something good happens, I will always have you guys by my side and uh, always have you guys to thank. And all as long as, along with all the other content creators and especially uh, M. Frisk. Uh, I don't remember when I hit 2K subs. I think that was honestly. Like a good month or two after 
for three months after I hit 1k. I know I hit 3k just recently, uh, but I, I don't know if I want to have any goals. I honestly don't know what my goal is for 2018. I know 20, 000, 2018 is going to be a hell of a year, uh, not just for me, but the entire MLB community. I can't wait for it. Uh, as you all know, there's the new Squad 8 announcement. Uh, I personally don't expect anything, usually. Uh, I don't expect anything at all, unless it's something that's been said, something that's been guaranteed. Uh, I, Because I don't want to disappoint myself. I don't want to be sad or disappointed that I don't get something or something isn't guaranteed like I think. Uh, so I know on Frisk's video about the new four new squad eight members, uh, I saw a lot, of, saw some people, not a lot, but I saw some people mention my name, and I, I just appreciate that. That I have people going in. I responded to all those comments with love heart because I want to show how much I appreciate it. Uh, just even being mentioned in all those awesome YouTubers that I believe should be in that opportunity of squad eight before me: Healy, Graphic Gaming, Kevin God. Uh, the list goes on. The editors, so many more people deserving than me, and I just feel humble that my main name even gets mentioned in a f top four category for that opportunity. And of course, I'm not expecting anything. And who I don't know, I know this video is going to go up before the announcement and before everyone knows who's, who's the four new members are. Uh, and those four new mem members, I congratulate you. Uh, but and good job. <laughs> that was poor sense structure, but. You got you got what I was thinking. Uh, with 2018 and the LMV community, my videos, uh, I do want to continue the House of That Junior build until at least the game comes out. Uh, maybe maybe until like two weeks before the game comes out. Uh, I do also want to start some BR again. If people want to see that, let me know down below uh, in the comment section if you would approve of that. I'm still probably gonna do it anyway. Uh, might bring back some ranked season gameplay with all the live series going on because that's the only final step I need for Pepe. Uh, and on, I think I'm thinking about bringing live streams back. I my last live stream I believe was in September. Uh, I had some people commenting every now and then, you know, where's the live stream? And if I'm in Kooks's live stream or uh, Fricks, Frisks, Mighty Goats, etc., all their live streams, they ask, you know, hey Serenity, why haven't you streamed in a while? And I reply usually. So I haven't had the time. Um, that's kind of the case, and that's kind of the not. It's kind of my lazy factor. Um, sometimes I don't have the time. Sometimes I just don't feel. Uh, I just don't. Sometimes I just. Uh, what's the? I can't. I blanking out right now. But sometimes I just don't really feel like doing it. If that makes sense. Uh, I did have fun. I, I'm, I had fun when I did all my live streams, but um, I, don't, I don't know. I really don't know. I do, however, plan on uh, doing more of them for 2018. Specifically, uh, f like having sponsor tournaments. I know that's not original, but uh, I'd love to do that if I get more sponsors. I know I still have one, uh, which is Snuggles, since for three months, which... Honestly, I you really I you don't need to be sponsoring me, but I appreciate it very very much. Uh, also, just viewer games. I know a bunch of people have been you know I don't understand. You know, I personally don't myself don't understand the huge importance in it, but I know people have asked me uh, if, for if they want to play me and stuff in the MLB game. Uh, I'll probably be doing viewer games on Saturdays, and so I don't you know do it on the same day as Coogs. Maybe even Fridays, who knows, like late, like a little, like when I get home on Fridays, because I know I'm in the Pacific Standard Time, so would, when I would probably start that stream, it would be like 7 o'clock for Eastern, and then 6 o'clock Central, but more than likely on Saturdays, or in the early of the day, uh, and also just streaming new content when it comes out, you know, of course, I'm in high school right now, uh, I won't be, like, I probably won't be able to do that at all, but... I could stream. I mean, you know, could probably stream grinding content with you guys, chilling out, having a good time, uh, playing battle royale, playing ranked seasons. You know, all of the above. If you want, if you would be interested in seeing that return, let me know. I'm probably, I'm still probably gonna do it either way. 
if some haters like you know go after yourself who cares like honestly i'll probably talk about that too even though it's probably not it's not even worth mentioning because i know someone's gonna say oh don't worry about the haters even though i i don't really i don't at all uh this is really kind of advice to you know, i'm not big at all but uh, this is advice to like even younger people than me wanting to start out and have a channel and they don't know what to do. I know I've seen constant people go into Coog's stream and get timed out just because they want to promote themselves and you know grow. That is the wrong way to do that. You never want to do that. You come off as a jerk and you're gonna get you know timed out and banned from multiple chats and you're not gonna get to interact in them anymore. Uh, and anyway that's that was a side that was a kind of a side track on it there but if you're i think we talked about this in q stream yes like yesterday or the other day uh i don't remember who it was but uh someone mentioned uh should they do webcam um because they're only 12 and they're worried about haters you know haters are shouldn't make you worried at all uh, but if you, I know if you have self-conscious, if you're self-conscious about yourself, uh, it can be really, really hard. Uh, especially with bringing in a new thing like a face reveal. It took I, I was really self-conscious about that. And I focused on the haters and it got to me. And I didn't want to do it. And then I made the video, the face reveal, confidence video. I don't, I mean, I mean it was kind of a dumb video. But it gave me confidence to you know have my face in all my videos almost all of them from now like from now that video since that video came out can't speak english but uh if you receive a comment saying uh you're fat you stink your voice is low you know, like you, your voice is funny cut your hair or like you look ugly like you just ignore them fuck them i know i cursed get over it <laughs> uh like seriously f them like just ignore them if you want to just block them on your channel you don't have to see their comments remove their comment don't even don't give them uh the light of day don't reply to them unless you want to you know be like mighty go and sometimes me and just respond with something funny like one time i think this one kid commented on my quiz video and said you don't know anything without the sh MLB the show you'd be nothing and dude when I read that I was dying that was hilarious that was such a dumb comment that was laughing for five minutes and I was just responded with LMA and then a hundred O's so it was like a paragraph because I don't care no you should not care about the haters I don't care about them and just laughing at them is just it's, you know it's quite funny uh, but I don't know how long this video has been. Uh, it's been 15 minutes. I think that's a good place to stop. I want to thank you all for being a part of my 2017, being a part of the Furrow Gang, and helping me, I guess, because YouTube is a source of entertainment. It's a hobby. It's a source of me being happy in life. Of course, I'm not depressed, but uh, I was through going through a hard times earlier in 2017 and youtube really helped me out have making videos having people be entertained people enjoying your videos it just makes me happy and i i i just can't thank you all enough thank you all for being a part of my 2017 can't wait for you all to be a part of my 2018 and i can't wait to grow even more Hope you guys have a great rest of your day. I'll see you all next time. So this money shit. Yeah, it's been on my mind. Fuck your posse clip. I'ma pop off in time with the Tommy mess. Yeah, this how I slime. I'm out to see some tits. Yeah, your mommy is fine. Hey, I'm a good boy. I don't hit no licks, yeah. I'm a bad boy. Flexing with some chicks, yeah. I'm a weird boy. Smoking on some grits, yeah. Oh, that boy, huh? I'm that boy, yeah.